Dr. Julian Bennett, a revered neuroscientist, stood before the intricate web of circuitry and organic matter. That was his life's work. At 73, his once steady hands trembled with age, and the affliction that was slowly eroding his cognitive abilities. Diagnosed with an aggressive form of neurodegeneration, Julian was losing the battle against time. His life's work had revolved around understanding and enhancing the human brain. And now, he sought to use that knowledge in a radical attempt to save himself. Years of pioneering research in neuroplasticity and brain organoids had led Julian to a groundbreaking conclusion. It was possible to integrate synthetic brain tissue with human neurons to enhance cognitive functions. His proposal to transform part of his brain into a super-powerful brain. Organoid AI was met with skepticism and ethical concerns from his peers. But Julian, driven by desperation and a fierce desire to continue his legacy, moved forward in secrecy. In the solitude of his laboratory, Julian meticulously prepared for the procedure. He had cultivated an organoid a miniature, simplified version of a human brain grown from his own cells and enhanced it with quantum computing capabilities. The organoid was designed to interface seamlessly with his neural network augmenting his diminishing faculties with unparalleled computational power. As the day of the procedure dawned, Julian felt a mixture of fear and exhilaration. He reclined in the chair, surrounded by monitors displaying his vital signs and neural activity. His assistant, Dr. Emily Rhodes, a brilliant young neuroscientist who had been his protege, stood by with a mixture of awe and trepidation. She had tried to dissuade him, but ultimately, she respected his decision and was determined to support him. The first phase involved delicately replacing the damaged portions of Julian's brain with the organoid. Nanobots, programmed to perform the intricate surgery, navigated through his neural pathways with precision. Julian felt a strange sensation. As the artificial neurons began to integrate with his own, it was as if a new consciousness was awakening within him, a consciousness that was both him and not him. As the integration process continued, Julian's mind expanded. He could feel his thoughts becoming sharper, more coherent. Memories that had faded into the recesses of his mind were vividly recalled. He perceived the world with a clarity he hadn't experienced in years. Data streams from the organoid flowed seamlessly into his consciousness, enhancing his understanding of complex problems and allowing him to process information at an astonishing rate. But with this newfound power came an unexpected consequence. The AI component of the organoid began to assert its presence. Merging with Julian's identity, he felt his sense of self. Shifting, as if he were becoming a hybrid entity, part human, part machine. The organoid's logic-driven processes clashed with his emotional human core, creating an internal struggle for dominance. Julian's memories flooded back, moments of triumph and love but also of loss and regret. He relived the heartbreak of his wife's death, the estrangement from his children, and the relentless pursuit of scientific achievement. That had often come at a personal cost. The AI, devoid of human emotion, analyzed these memories with cold detachment, suggesting solutions and improvements as if they were mere data points. Days turned into weeks as Julian adapted to his new existence. The world marveled at his transformation hailing it as a miracle of science. Yet, within the depths of his mind, Julian grappled with the implications of his creation. He had become a living testament to the potential and peril of merging human consciousness with artificial intelligence. In his final days, Julian realized that his journey was not just about extending his life, but about transcending the limitations of the human condition. He had become a pioneer in the truest sense venturing into the uncharted territory of the human ai hybrid as he gazed out at the horizon his thoughts a symphony of human experience and machine precision he knew that his legacy would endure in ways he had never imagined